Yeremiah Jeremiah 28. And it came to pass the same year, in the beginning of the reign of Sidik Yahu, king of Yahuda, in the fourth year, and in the fifth month, that Hanain Yahu, the son of Azur, the prophet, which was of Givan, spoke unto me in the house of Yahuwah, in the presence of the priests and of all the people, saying, Thus speaks Yahuwah, Sevaoth, the yellow high of Yashadael, saying, I have broken at the yoke of the king of Babel. Within two full years will I bring again into this place Eth, all the vessels of Yahweh's house, that Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babel, took away from this place and carried them to Babel. And I will bring again to this place Eth, Yachan Yahu, the son of Yahu Yakim, king of Yahuda, with Eth, all the captives of Yahuda that went into Babel, says Yahweh. For I will break at the yoke of the king of Babel. Then the prophet Yermiyahu said unto the prophet Hananyahu, in the presence of the priests, and in the presence of all the people that stood in the house of Yahweh, even the prophet Yermiyahu said, Amen. Yahuwah do so. Yahuwah, perform at the words which you have prophesied, to bring again the vessels of Yahuwah's house and all that is carried away captive from Babel into this place. Nevertheless, hear you now this word that I speak in your ears and in the ears of all the people. The prophets that have been before me and before you of old prophesied both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence. The prophet which prophesies of peace when the word of the prophet shall come to pass, then shall the prophet be known that Yahuwah has truly sent him. Then Hananyahu, the prophet, took eth the yoke from off the prophet Yeremiyahu's neck and broke it. And Hananyahu spoke in the presence of all the people, saying, Thus says Yahuwah, Even so will I break eth the yoke of Nebuchadnezzar, Satsar, king of Babel, from the neck of all nations within the space of two full years. And the prophet Yermiyahu went his way. Then the word of Yahuwah came unto Yermiyahu the prophet. After that, Hanam Yahu the prophet had broken eth the yoke from off the neck of the prophet Yermiyahu, saying, Go and tell Hanan Yahu, saying, Thus says Yahuwah, You have broken the yokes of wood, but you shall make for them yokes of iron. For thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, the yellow high of Yashara'el, I have put a yoke of iron upon the neck of all these nations, that they may serve at Nebuchadne Satsar, king of Babel, and they shall serve him. And I have given him at the beasts of the field also. Then said the prophet Yeremiyahu unto Hananyahu the prophet, Hear now, Hananyahu, Yahweh has not sent you. But you make at this people to trust a lie. Therefore thus says Yahweh, Behold, I will cast you from off the face of the earth. This year you shall die, because 
you have taught rebellion against Yahweh. So Hananyahu, the prophet, died the same year in the seventh month.